Hello and welcome everyone to yet another tech enthusiastic video from Edureka. Books are considered to be the best companions and nothing can beat books when it comes to educating. That is the reason most of the seasoned Java programmers as well as experts recommend books for learning Java. Books contain authentic and in-depth knowledge that is often written by a person having authority on the subject matter. Thus, I bring you this video where I will be sharing you the list of top 10 books to learn Java. I have categorized the books into two sections. The first one will be based on Fresh's point of view while the other one is based on experienced professionals which will help them to gain skills to upgrade their careers. Now, before we get started, subscribe to Edureka YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to never miss an update from us on trending technologies. Also, if you're looking for an online training certification in Java, then please check out the link in the description box below. Now, without wasting much time, let us quickly start with our agenda which will tell us about the books that we are going to discuss in today's session. Firstly, the beginners level category which will deal with head first Java, clean code, Java the complete reference, Java concurrency in practice, effective Java. Now let's get started. So the first book that we will be discussing in our first category, the beginners level is the head first Java. The author of the head first Java is Kathy Sierra and Bert Bates. The latest version of this particular book which is the second edition has been recently published. It was published by the most famous publisher which is none other than Shroff O'Reilly. If you're just getting started with Java, there is no other book better than Head First Java. This book is really simple that explains the concepts in layman's terms and easily relates the Java programming concepts to real life analogies. This book covers all the object oriented programming concepts in great detail which makes the beginner to easily get the hang of programming in Java. A few other helpful topics covered in this book are common object oriented mistakes, distributed programming with RMI and network sockets and threads along with 42 mind bending puzzles for a thorough understanding of the concepts. Though this book hasn't been updated after Java 5.0, Still, it is an absolute stepping stone for a building programmer. Now, followed by the head first Java, we have another book by the name Clean Code, a handbook of agile software craftsmanship. The author for this particular book is Robert Martin, also known as Uncle Bob. Its first edition has been published by the most famous publishers, the Pearson Education. Clean Code is one of the classic books preferred by Java programmers. If you are a noob, this book will definitely help you constructing better code, which otherwise can be a bit challenging. While this book is mainly centered around the object oriented principles, you will find this book divided into three sections based on the level of complexity of the concepts. The first section which covers the patterns, practices and principles which are the pillars for writing clean code. The next section covers a wide range of case studies in an ascending complexity order. Finally, the third section which is just one chapter focuses on a list of techniques gathered while curating the case studies in the previous section of this book. To conclude I would say this book will give you a strong base for building knowledge on Java and teach you various programming techniques and practices that will eventually help you in day to day life as a programmer. Now followed by the clean code the third book in the list is Java the complete reference. This book was written by Herbert Schilt. The latest version of this particular book is the 11th edition and it is published by the famous publishers McGraw-Hill Education. This book is one of the most recommended and easily available books to get your hands on Java programming. It might not be that helpful for a complete in a voice, but if you have a basic understanding of Java, then this book will work wonders for you. As the name suggests, it is a very convenient and comprehensive reference book with over 1000 pages. This book is a well structured and fully featured source of Java programming with real world examples. This book is a perfect tool for learning Java as it covers basic Java concepts such as Java 8 APIs, fundamental programming principles, Java language syntax and keywords with extensive topics like Java beans, servlets, applets and swing. So if you're on a journey to master Java, this book is a perfect match for you. Followed by Java the complete reference, the fourth book in the list is 
Java Concurrency in Practice. The authors for this particular book are Brian, Tim, Joshua, Joseph, David, and Dudley. The latest edition of this particular book is being published by Addison Weasley Professional. This book is not definitely for the noobs, but it is definitely for the programmers whose feet are already wet with Java programming. The Java Concurrency in Practice book is one of the best Java programming books out there if you want to gain a rich understanding of Java concepts such as concurrency and multi-threading. It is very essential for any ardent Java developer but might appear a bit challenging at the beginning. Thus, before you jump onto this book, I would suggest you to get your basics done. Else, this book will appear as an alien language book to you. But let me make one thing very clear. There is no better book than Java Concurrency for learning concurrency and multi-threading in Java, which is an integral part of this language. So the fifth book in the docket is Effective Java, and the author is Joshua Block. The latest edition of this particular book is the third edition published by Addison Weasley. The book Effective Java falls under the category of must-have book for every Java programmer as well as Java aspirant. This book can be referred to along with other Java books or learning material. This book basically constitutes 78 best practices that help a programmer to code effectively. All the mentioned best practices in this book have been categorized into 11 distinct sections like concurrency, generics, and methods. This makes the learning curve shallower and helps in better understanding. The book hands down something to Java programmers of any skill level. The latest edition of this book is strongly built around Java version 7, version 8, and version 9. So with this, we conclude the first category of the top 10 books for learning Java. Followed by the beginner's level, we have the advanced level. In this category, the books discussed are Java, a beginner's guide, Java performance, a definitive guide, spring in action, test driven, mastering Java machine learning. Now we shall move ahead and understand the remaining five books for learning Java. The sixth book in the docket is Java, a beginner's guide. The author is Herbert Schild and the latest edition of this particular book is the eighth edition published by McGraw-Hill Education. As the saying goes, never judge a book by its cover. Well, in this case, by its title. Though the title says beginner's guide, actually this book is very useful even for the seasoned Java programmers. It is one of the most comprehensive and complete books available in the market for learning Java. It comes with extensive hands-on exercises as well as a quiz section at the end of each chapter. This enables the reader to self-evaluate his or her learning journey. With the latest edition release, this book has been fully revised to include Java 11 SE, which means it includes complex concepts such as lambda expressions and functional interfaces. So this might be the book just what you're looking for. Now, followed by Java A Beginner's Guide, the seventh book in the docket is The Definitive Guide to Java Performance. The author is Scott Oakes and the latest edition has been published by O'Reilly Media. Moving further into advanced Java programming, we come across the concepts such as garbage collection, Java virtual machine, and performance tuning and many more. The only way of mastering these concepts is through the book Java Performance. This book covers all the above mentioned topics in a simplest yet effective manner. This book will teach you how to maximize Java threading and synchronization performance features, improve Java driven database applications, tackle performance issues in Java EE and Java SE APIs and many more. So followed by the Java performance, the eighth book in the list is Spring in Action. The author of Spring in Action is Craig Walls and the latest edition, which is the fifth edition, has been published by Manning Publications. Learning Java will always be incomplete without learning about at least one of its frameworks. Spring is one of the most heavily used Java frameworks for web application developments. You can learn it easily through this Spring in Action book. This book doesn't just focus on Spring framework, but along with the course, you will dig deeper into the concepts like JDBC, to find out the unseen shortcomings of JDK and many more. Not just this, 
This book will also tell you how the Spring framework helps in filling these small yet significant gaps. One thing is for sure, once you are through this book, you will discover new horizons of Java. Now, the ninth book in the docket is Test Driven. Test Driven Design and Acceptance, Test Driven Design for Java Developers. So the author for this particular book is Lasse Koskela. The latest edition of this particular book has been published by Manning Publications. For the programmers who want to change their field from developing to testing, this book is a perfect solution for you. This book is an excellent book for learning how to build unique automation testing programs. This book provides industry-based examples to test drive Java code. It also covers topics like acceptance test-driven development, the FIT framework, and testing Java EE components, JSPs, servlets, and Spring controllers. So, if you're one among those who prioritize code quality, as well as have a knack for writing unit, integration, and automation testing, this book is definitely for you. So, followed by test-driven, the last book in the list is Mastering Java Machine Learning. The author is Uday Kamat. The latest edition, which is the second edition, has been published by Pact Publishing. This book covers a wide range of topics that are used rigorously today in the machine learning domain. Through this book, you will gain a comprehensive knowledge of linear algebra, probability, and statistics. Not only this, but through the Java machine learning book, you will also learn about standard issues such as text mining, classification, clustering, big data, and machine learning. The main highlight of this book is that it is loaded with 10 real-world case studies, each of them highlighting various techniques of machine learning. So, in case you have already mastered Java, this will help you in exploring the new domain of machine learning. Now, with this book, we have come to an end of this session. If you have any queries related to this session, then please feel free to write them down in the comment section below. Till then, thank you and happy learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!